Yeah, back in 2015, the Lancashire County Council rejected both applications. And it wasn't just Lancashire County Council, the Parish Council, the Borough Council, the County Council all rejected these applications. Uh, Cordula quickly jumped in with an appeal, um, and then the government supported that appeal, and they overturned it early, you know, at the end of last year. The uh, government decided that they knew better, despite their regular uh, claims that they believe in local democracy. That only applies if local, local politicians decide something that they agree with. Uh, if they decide something they don't agree with, then local democracy clearly goes out the window. People locally don't want this. You know, the residents don't want it, the council doesn't want it. So why, why is this government trying to force it on ordinary people who, who don't want it on the doorstep, don't want it anywhere in this country? When I retired from work six years ago, just as the shale gas industry was coming into the file, I did not think that six years on I'd be standing on Preston New Road daily objecting to this industry but we're getting great support from local people i never thought i could be so uplifted by somebody honking the horn at me it's amazing so from the 5th of january onwards they've been here every day uh, and apart from last week i've been here every day as well uh, and uh, as you can see they've made some progress but i am assured that they're at least two weeks behind schedule it's just dangerous in short term i mean the big thing for me is that we're talking about this as a transition to renewables, to a clean energy future, but that clean energy future has been ripped away. It's a very high impact uh, industry, it's very invasive and it, there's too many risks, there's too many risks to people's health, there's too many risks to our environment, you know, to the water, to the soil, to the air, there's too many risks to um, our climate change, you know, I mean, this is a fossil fuel industry. It, it's a backward step. Why, are we, why, why is this government and why are we going backwards when we should be looking at renewables and clean forms of energy? I feel totally let down by the fact that this government thinks it's appropriate, uh, despite the fact that they know fossil fuels are contributing to global warming, but they are all prepared to launch a brand new fossil fuel industry. Today they brought on some serious heavy duty vehicles, uh, which is really quite heartbreaking because uh, you know, they are obviously very serious about this. People need to wake up and see that this is just the first potential well. So people across the country can help in, in so many different ways, you know, just by speaking out to your local politicians, uh, canvassing them, lobbying, writing to your MP, writing to your local newspaper, supporting the anti-fracking groups. There's lots and lots of different ways to show that you're opposed to this. And, you know, people need to speak out. Because at the end of the day, this is not just about Preston New Road, it's not even just about Lancashire. This has national and global implications. If, if fracking, the fracking industry gets a hold in the UK, as you are aware, there are pedal licenses up and down the country, and uh, the battle here today is everybody else's battle tomorrow. We will not have it. It will not happen. We will stop it.